Gardner. Mr. Gardner Building is Majestic. It's my podcast. It's the G1 Truth Podcast. I'm doing it big right now. I'm out here in Charlotte. You know what I'm saying? I'm kicking it with my man, Big Row Now Rule, CEO, DTP affiliate. I got the guard Big D with me. We out here. We doing it North Carolina style. But yo, I had to, you know, splash y'all real quick with another quick episode from my um podcast. We doing another unboxing for Threadbeast. For those that don't know, y'all know how I get down with Threadbeast. I fuck with them hard body. So let me give y'all a quick breakdown before we do this unboxing and show my man D what I'm really working with right now. Um, Threadbeast unboxing, for those that don't know, if you got a problem picking out your gear or what to wear, or you may be even tired of your girl picking out your shit for you, or you don't know how to look through your shit and get your shit jazzy or get your shit fresh to death, this is one way how you do it. Fuck with Threadbeast. Check out their website. Threadbeast is very unique in the sense that when you go online and you pick out your clothes through Threadbeast, what you just actually did was pick out a personal stylist. Someone that's going to look at what you, they're going to go on your Instagram page. They're going to look at what your style is, what you wear, and then they're going to try to accessorize your look and make your shit a little bit better so your shit can pop off. So that's why I fuck with, with Threadbeast. If you want to rock with Threadbeast, I strongly suggest you do it. I'm going to put up a link with the code so that you can get 50% off your next package and just tell them, yo, I rocked out with Majestic, the G1 True podcast. He picked up Threadbeast. So this is where we at. So let's get into it. What's up, everybody? It's the Threadbeast unboxing. It's the God Majestic. I got my man D with me. D, and for those that don't know, check for the homie. You know what I'm saying? My man Pen Game is sick and his production game is up. I want him to put y'all on to some artists that he's working with right now. Y'all gonna get to see all that in a minute. But for right now, we're gonna rock this unboxing. So before I get to it, you know, I ordered the baller package. You know what I'm saying? So when you do the baller package, the baller package is gonna come with a whole bunch of clothes that you're about to see. But what makes that different from the premium package or the basic package is that you're not going to get the sneakers. You know what I'm saying? So if you step your game up and spend maybe a little bit extra, like 50 or 60 bucks, you can come up with the sneakers. And you just got to hope that, um, you know, they picked out something that you like. So this is where we at. So uh, it's the Threadbeast unboxing. Here we go. I always love how they send my shit. You know what I'm saying? Even the box is flavorful. I just like how everything is looking crispy and new. You know what I'm saying? So we're going to rock out. We gotta open this. Place the camera, recording, trying to open. And this is what we're working with. We're gonna pull. We're gonna pull that up a little bit so you guys can see this. Cameraman, cameraman, cameraman. <laughs> Here we go. It's the thread piece unboxing. All right, so you see how they rock out. They're going to make sure I'm fresh from head to toe, and I can't even front on Threadbeast. There was times I knocked Threadbeast, and I didn't really appreciate some of the stuff they sent me, but what was dope about them, that if I told them I didn't like something, yo, they didn't even ask for the shit back. They said, yo, we're going to make sure on the next package this shit is tight. And every time that I did that, they came through correctly. So that's why I always got a big up Threadbeast, and I would recommend this shit to anybody. So here's what we rocking with. I'm out here in Charlotte. We actually going to do a concert tonight with the sister, Naya Perry. She got some dope shit. Y'all about to see that too. If y'all don't know her, check for on the gram, Anaya Perry, you know what I'm saying? She's an internet sensation, got over a million followers, she do a thug thizzle. So I'm going to make sure I'm fresh for the concert tonight. So I'm here in the hotel, I'm doing my unboxing, we starting out with these shower slippers, you know what I'm saying? I, I believe these are Pink Dolphin, I think that's the brand, because I got some clothes from them. It's pretty fly, you know, not my particular favorite, but you know, the company is based in California, so, you know, they're going to, you know, it's a little California color, that's what I call it, California colors, you know what I'm saying? So we got that. That's not that's decent. And mind you, if you brought all of this stuff after you see it, you're gonna really spend like maybe a buck fifty, two hundred dollars. I'm not quite sure, but you know what I'm saying? They they do a good job for the money. They really put your shit together here. Here's a little pants. I'm not very uh I'm not friendly with the elastic, you know what I'm saying, shit. But this is what it is. Black pair of joints, black joints. It's basic, but it's nice when a cool out day, you can rock that. You know what I'm saying? You getting mm -hmm. that? Mm-hmm. You know, put on the bitch. Look at it. It's decent, not bad. So we got, uh, what would you cons consider these? Are these sweats? Feel that material. Shit, this is some loungewear. Loungewear shit. Stick, you know what I'm saying? So you can, you can wear it out. You know, you know what I'm saying? saying? So it's decent. Pair of pants, little shower slippers for all my niggas, you know what I'm saying, on, on lockdown. If you need a pair of these, you're on lockdown, you know what I'm saying, you fly me a kite, I may send these to you so you can rock these shit in the joint, you know what I'm saying, got yourself a little fresh pair of slouches. I know they ain't Gucci, but they dope still. 
You know what I'm saying? All right, these is decent. I'm feeling these. I love jeans when they got a color because I'm not really good at color jeans. So if somebody ever picked them out for me, I'll rock them. You know, this kind of stone wash is great. This is Jake <clears throat> Austin. You know what I'm saying? It's decent. It's rockable. You know what I'm saying? I like it. Piece of color. It's good for the Nunu. You're not going to get broke fucking with Thread Beast on point. Let's see the t-shirt game. Here's a t-shirt. This is uh, Penguin. Never heard of him. It's kind of, I don't know. It's cute. Not necessarily my stilo, but you know. It's crisp. If you want to rock it out one day, head out, go to a little bar, cafe on a little afternoon. You're sitting, kicking it with your peoples. You ain't trying to get too jazzy. Just clean. Keeping it clean. You can rock that. You know what I'm saying? Not decent. Check that out. I never go wrong with Levi. Levi is always my official brand. You know what I'm saying? I'm on my grown ass, man. I've been wearing Levi's since I was a kid. So you can't go wrong rocking Levi's. And I like a good Levi t-shirt. You know what I'm saying? The material is always rugged. So you, it's good for a good couple of washes. It's not going to stretch on you or the material is not going to look fucked up and worn. I still got Levi's joints that I've been rocking with for like 10, 15 years. I still rock them as long as they go to the cleaners, keep it crispy. You know what I'm saying? Get your shit dry clean. Here's another joint. Black is always my color. Big shout out to the homie Blackout. That remind me of my man Blackout because my man used to rock this shirt when I did that interview. Big shout out to San Antonio, Texas. My man Blackout in the building. You know what I'm saying? And it's just a basic black t-shirt, black scale. You know, good for that. Uh, again, good for that everyday wear. I wish it was a little bit more fitted since I dropped some weight, but you know what I'm saying? It'll fit good. It's crispy. It's clean. Not bad. And still, you're still getting this. It's a good bang for the buck, so you still can't go wrong. And so what we got here, one, two, two t-shirts, two pairs of pants, a pair of shower slippers. We're on the third t-shirt. You know what I'm saying? And this is what? This is Adidas. Not bad. You know what I'm saying? So now we're getting more with the label whore. I'm being a label whore right now. It's Adidas t-shirt. It's good. It's decent. Not too fancy and not too plain. You know what I'm saying? Got some little um, design here that got the little the, the Adidas stripe. You know what I'm saying? With the Adidas pocket. It's decent. Pocket got a little different color to it to give it some dimension and shit. That's decent. Big shout out to Threadbeast for that. I'm feeling you on that. I'm still rocking with you. And, um, I don't know, some... It's the Miami shorts. Yeah, this is some Miami Hopefully shit you, right here. It's some slim you, you know what I'm saying? Real you know, they say, you know, players don't, don't, they don't get played out. They get chubby and move to Miami. So I guess that's what it is. You know what I'm saying? This is that Miami way or that California way. You want to beat you and kicking it. I'm in Charlotte. I will not be wearing these. It is November. It is winter time, and it is cold as a witch's tit. You know what I'm saying? So that completes the gear side of things. You know what I'm saying? But peep this out. I, this is why I fuck with Threadbees because when you really rock with Threadbees, they're gonna make sure you're good from head to toe. They really do a good job at that. I've gotten socks, underwears, wallets, hats, everything for the complete ensemble. So. I was just rapping with my man Ro because we drove to Charlotte. I was smoking in the car. The nigga was complaining about smoking cigarettes because they fucking up his um three hundred dollar uh Tom Ford cologne. Look, I'm from Flatbush. I wear Muslim oil from Utica Avenue. Serves me just fine. Doesn't make much of a difference. However, I do have me some um black diamond cologne. This is also from Thread Beast. And big shout out to Thread Beast for doing that. So they're making sure I smell fresh, you know what I'm saying? It's not Tom Ford. Didn't cost um, $300. However, still a good deal for a brother like myself. Cost conscious. So, not time for it, bro. And these socks, I'm feeling these. You know what I'm saying? I don't really care, like the pink part of it, but I do like how the the color cascades, you know what I'm saying, into different colors. You know what I'm saying? And it's kind of jazzy. So, this is classic crew socks, Rich Porter. You know what I'm saying? So, they're still making sure you keep your shit funky from head to toe. So we got a pair of socks. Now, um, like I said, Red Beast, make sure your shit get blessed. So here's what we're working with. Head to toe, y'all, another watch. Now, I'm going to have to call them because they already sent me this watch. You know what I'm saying? This is a, a Nikon, basic black watch, just to help you accessorize your whole shit. We're back with the final piece of the unboxing. You know what I'm saying? We had a little technical difficulty. It's okay, though. I'm not going to blame anybody. You know, I'm not going to. It's all right. I understand. Professionalism is key. Um, so, 
Yeah. This is the last part of the unboxing. They sent me a pair of Adidas. Actually, big shout out to Threadbeats. On the last joint, y'all sent me a pair of classic Jordans. I rock them shits. When I put them shits on, everybody's like, damn, you rocking them classic shit. So y'all help keep my shit wavy. I definitely appreciate that. These are the Adidas joints. You know what are these? Which type of Adidas are these? You know? They got a little mix in there with the top tens. I see that already. That's a classic. You know what I'm saying? I'm feeling it. It's got the gumshoe bottom, so I was always feeling that. I like how that is out there. You know what I'm saying? That little print back there. And you can't really see inside, but if I can show y'all the inside, it's got the uh, sole that, that kind of matches the, the, the bottom of the shoe. I can't pull it out completely. But you know what I'm saying? It's a little jazzy, and this is what I'm probably going to rock out with today. And this is all from Threadbeast. You know what I'm saying? So y'all know what it is. It's the Thread Beast Unboxing. It's the God Majestic. I'm in the building. It's the G1 Truth Podcast. Y'all know how I get down. I go everywhere. I eat everything. I talk to everybody. Cooling it out here in Charlotte with my man Big Bro. I got Big D in the building. Charlotte's in effect. Brooklyn is in effect. ATL is in effect. You know how we get down. We do this shit worldwide. Check for me on the gram. Do me a solid. Hit that goddamn um, subscribe button. Do to help me with that campaign. Follow me on YouTube. Follow me on Snapchat. Follow me on Twitter. Follow me on Facebook. And follow me on the gram. It's the God Majestic. It's the Thread Beast Unboxing. I'm in the building. Holla at the God. One. <laughs>